And while many say solar power is safe and better for the environment, one plant using that form of energy isn't quite as clean as many had hoped. Ikenda McGehee investigates. The biggest crisis facing the world is climate disruption. And what is driving climate disruption is carbon pollution from cars, coal-fired power plants, natural gas-fired power plants. It's essential quickly to develop clean energy that will minimize the harm from climate disruption. That was the idea behind developing large-scale renewable energy projects on public, undeveloped swaths of California land. Built in the midst of the Mojave Desert, amid a delicate ecosystem of desert wildlife and plant species, is Ivanpah, the world's largest solar thermal power plant. The owners of the project, NRG Energy and Bright Source Energy, say three towers, more than 350,000 mirrors, and the sun's singular focus generate enough electricity to power 140,000 homes. But what appears a desert oasis from a distance? On closer inspection is merely a mirage, in more ways than one, say environmentalists. Starting with uh, the direct destruction of uh, desert habitat that uh, has been lived on without destruction by humans for 10,000 years, scraped bare uh, so that uh, they can put up mirrors. And uh, essentially destroying species, centuries old plants, uh, desert tortoise. It's like the lake effect, they think it's a lake. Another problem is that the, there are enormously high temperatures that uh, are created and that can actually scorch the wings right off of birds. Anything that man does has some impact on the environment. So NRG's goal is to have a sustainable product. But environmental groups say this plant isn't sustainable at all. The price to run it is enormous. The electricity it generates is more costly than coal. And the damage to the environment can neither be tallied nor reversed. BrightSource says plans are on indefinite hold for a third California solar farm. Yekenda McGahee, CCTV, Ivanpah Dry Lake Bed, California.